granulomatous meningoencephalomyelitis, or GME, is an inflammatory disease of the central, that is the brain and spinal cord nervous system. It is a disease with a progressive and oftentimes untreatable or incurable pattern. GME is a disease that affects young to middle-aged small breed terrier dogs three to six years of age, females more strikingly than any other. It does affect other age groups and other animals or other dogs. It has not been diagnosed in cats at this time. Current theories with GME are related towards an immunologically mediated reaction and most studies to date have shown that it has a similar characteristic to and a what we call a T-cell immunity reaction. Extrapolations to human medicine suggest that this may actually be a early form of central nervous system lymphoma, specifically a B-cell lymphoma. This is harder to grasp and to fight for since the nervous system really doesn't have a lymphatic system. The breakdown in terminology then starts. GME starts as either a focal, meaning one site, or multifocal, more than one site, disease of either the brain or the spinal cord or both. A rarer form, but just as deadly, is a form which involves the optic or visual nerves. This form causes acute blindness, although rarely involves the rest of the brain or the nervous system, so prognosis with the optic nerve form is greater than the other forms. GME strikes with rapidity, it progresses, it causes dysfunction of the nervous system and pain. Current treatment is related to the use of what we call immunomodulants, glucocorticoids or steroids such as prednisone, dexamethasone, and more recently more aggressive immunomodulants and chemotherapeutic agents such as cytosine, low mustine or CNU, and cyclosporin. With current treatment, long-term prognosis for survival and quality of life is considered two to four years. Prior Treatments allowed for three to nine months of life before termination.